Two. Number two, we are focusing on the local impact as well of this global outage. And 10 News reporter Lauren Lovett is giving us an update on agencies that have been infected here. Lauren? Yeah, this morning, FedEx released a statement saying they are facing disruptions and services may be delayed. We reached out to some local FedEx stores around 10 a.m. and they said they're not seeing any issues. We haven't seen any reports from any other mail carriers like UPS or USPS. And so while our local stores may not be seeing any problems, be sure to call or check online to see if your package deliveries might be delayed. We've also been looking into how some of our healthcare systems have been impacted. We heard from Tenova around 8 a.m. that all of their systems are up and running. A UT Medical Center spokesperson got back to us at 1127 saying some of their systems have been impacted. We called back recently and they said that's still true. Now, but they're saying the center is still fully operational and there have been no changes to patient care. Well, Lauren, certainly you've been working the phones all day to learn more about this. That's right, Brittany. We're watching the continued impact here in East Tennessee and beyond, and we'll be looking deeper into other local agencies at 430. We will see you then. Thanks, Lauren.